guys, light bulb here and boomer here. This is NBA playoffs on 2K Sports. And now we're ready to find out for its next matchup. As right now, we've got another matchup for you. It's the Los Angeles Clippers and they're facing against the Dallas Mavericks here at Dallas at American Airlines Center. The starting of the matchup is right in between our neighbor opponents. James Harden is with Terrence Mann. Paul George with Kawhi Leonard. And Ivica Zubox in the center. Then Daniel Gafford's also in center with TJ Washington. Then it's Luka Doncic on the other side with Kyrie Irving. And Derek Jones is in the center. And now, let's get you covered here. For our next part of the commentators, I will have is Brian Anderson. Along with the 2K Sports crew and Ali LaForce will be on the sideline. We'll be back with the post-game show right after this. Let's get started, folks. Enjoy for your first of tonight's game in the Western Conference. And we'll see you back again after the final buzz horn before the post-game show. Let's roll. Let's meet your visiting team on the LA Clippers. A shooting guard, Terrence Mann. At center, Ivica Zubox. And here for position, no guard, James Harden. At small four, Paul George. We have the arrow four position, Kawhi Leonard. The Los Angeles Clippers head coach, Tyrone Lue. Let's meet your starting lineup for you, Dallas Mavericks. That's ball four and six point for me. Number 55. In your former position, at 6 foot 10, number 25, PJ Washington. Your middle, 6 foot, number 21, Daniel Gopher. Number your former jury guard, 6 feet. feet. Number 11, Kyrie Irving. Eight point guard, 6'6. Six, six, six. Number 77, Luca Duncan. Their coach, Jason Kidd. That's here for you. on the wing, defended by Harden. Jones from outside. It's rebounded by Zubats. And here are the Clippers now. Outside Harden. And there's the lob! And it's Zika Zubats. Use this from Zubats. James Harden. Doncic feeling it out a bit. Out left to the wing. 
Number 55, Derek Jones Jr. He scores first little foul. We're a scene foul. For the Los Angeles Clippers, on the free throw line, number 13, Paul George. Shutting down a team's perimeter all-star, that is rarefied air for a star player in this league. George hits them both. A great player on a great role as a charity stripe. The D has got to be careful about being too aggressive on him and sending him back for freebies. Pass to Doncic. Shoots over Harden. One of the most entertaining players in the league. Leonard against Washington. Now Zubats. Miko Zubats. And defensively, you have to make him work harder than this, or it's going to be a long night. Washington outside. Back to Dodgers. Outside Jones. The pass to Doncic. Fires the three. The shot, no good. And here's George. He'll bring it up for Los Angeles. Here's Leonard. The three is up. Gafford grabs a miss. George against Jones. Doncic on the wing. Side. Oh, it. allows him to play through contact. Surprised he didn't get the star treatment there. And the whole whistle. Here's George. And again, oh, George. Well, plenty of give and take so far. The six lead changes already. Both teams came to play. To the way, right side. Washington against Leonard. Back to Doncic. Six on the shot clock. Jones from outside. And that one fall for him. He's 0 for 2. And it's Leonard with the ball for the Clippers. Pass to Harden. There's the triple. Mavericks with the rebound. Man, that's his shot. Maybe he was too wide open. Jones, the pass to Gafford. Yes. on that play. Yeah, APB sent out to try to find out where the defense is. Inexcusable. Now here's Harden. Pass to man. And there's a three second. Three second violation. Mavericks ball. Gone one of four from deep. Well, if you're the Clippers, are you out looking for the next young star grid? Possibly be it. I mean, five of their top six. Free! Kyrie Irving! Don't you young guns to be a consistent contender? LA Clippers fall timeout. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. And things are always changing throughout a game. Teams have to adjust on the fly. And timeouts are a wonderful opportunity to just settle in and recollect the thoughts of your entire team. Not just the guys playing, but the entire team. And let me tell you this one here. This one happened with a couple seasons ago since season five of the postseason. 
they've done their way with their best, and since season three, they've been meeting each other right in between. But now, three seasons later, they're definitely just wanting to get into another postseason and rematch it again. There was no other question of how this is going to happen, but what in the world are they going to do now? They have nothing else to do to just be, hey, they train with each other, but this is not what they always say in it. Just in fact of it, it doesn't help. Hopefully there's another change out there that can go with another look. The maps happen to go with in between those zones. Back to you, Brian. And so here are the Clippers. Four point game. Here's George. Gafford grabs the miss. The Mavericks have gone five of eight. Solid opening quarter for them. Irving finds Jones. Harden with the defensive effort. And he gets a lot of points right there at the rim, but the defense determined not to give up the easy deuce there. Here's an eight-footer. And Gafford with the block. They recover it. Just five to shoot. They get the rebound. Miles has lost it. Projection! Now like Cooper's ball. So so Substitutional on the court. Now Cooper's ball. Here's the man. Foul. Number 10, Team Hardaway Jr. This one was supposed to go foul. Second team foul. Good for the LA Clippers, number 14, turns my head. They're the top of the league for attempts beyond the arc. They do it every chance they can get. Falls for him. Looks like this could be a bounce back here for the Clippers. Lose the positional on the court for the Mavericks. Just shake your head and you think about number zero. They're in Lyles. And number 42, Maxi Kleba. They're looking for some redemption this year, and you feel like it's their last shot. That one falls, so he hits both of them. Thinking back to one of the most fun runs in the NBA, Grant, those early 2000 Mavs teams. Oh, I played against those teams, and they were incredible offensively. Of course, you had Steve Rash. Maxi! Kleba! Now, look at that Well ahead of your time. Here's Westbrook. Following the score by Dallas. It's Powell on the way. From deep. It's rebounded by Dallas. Doncic passes to Kleba. Maxi Kleba. Kleba's gone. Luca gone. All eyes on Luca. The defense forgot about his teammates. Out to Powell. Pass to Man. Over to the left wing. Doncic against Westbrook. Pocket four. Out to the wing. Here's Plumley. It's hauled in by Luka Doncic. The Mavericks leading. Outside Hardaway. Doncic outside. Kleba passes to Lively. Kicks it to Doncic. Two minutes remaining in the first period. <laughs> Two minutes. Time call. Like the first call of timeout. Talk it over. Failing to find a rhythm offensively. Something that needs to change and change soon. Yeah, they're like a four-day-old soda right now, just flat. They're missing shots left and right, and just not playing their best. Well, here's the thing about that. All you say for now. They are not playing their best, but they are trying to look to them. No, they could try to win that one. 
It's not what they always do. Don't let them get an angle with this. They don't have enough time to have that moment if they can get this one here coming down. Maverick, Colt it out. It's just not always that good. Not possible enough that they could try to let them go into the flow. But don't let that one get anybody away. That is the tension score. It's not going to let that happen score now. Here's Powell. Hasn't gotten one to fall yet. And here's Westbrook. Inside. Kleba with a steal. Pass to Exum. Here's Lively. He's checked by Plumley. Kleba right side. And here's Doncic outside. It's hauled in by the Clippers. And this is exactly who you want taking that shot. I just missed it. Tucker, pass to Powell. They need this. Goldman Powell. This is from DJ and Tucker. Finding a way to set up a ready shooter. The Mavericks have got 8 of 13 attempts to go. Pass to Doncic. Hardaway against Powell. Attacking in the painted area. Clearly, that was their game plan coming in. Westbrook against Doncic. Only down low. Second chance effort. Goes up again. And he takes Mason it. Mason Plumley. Well, don't get surprised by that burst from Plumley. He crashes in for the rebound, has the athleticism, and finishes with authority. Westbrook against Doncic. Pass to Exum to the left side wing. And here's Doncic. Shot clock at six. Now Hardaway over Powell. That's good from Green Hardaway Jr. She just got four assists in the game. Here's Powell. There's the block. Great shot there. Nice touch by Clippers ball. Substitutional on the court. Number 11, Kyrie Irving. And number one, Jeff Green. Tice finds Powell. Four seconds left. Yes. Norman Powell. Yeah, just keeping it simple that time, Norman Powell. Nice job. That's the end of the first quarter. Dallas Mavericks, 23. Clippers, 16. More 2K action in just a moment. Hope you've enjoyed the broadcast so far. Halfway through the first half of this one. And a moment to check out the scoring breakdown for Dallas. Well, hey guys, I mean, can we talk about how unselfish they've been? Just racking up the assist numbers, moving it around with great precision. It feels like the three-point line has opened up really early in this one, too. They've been looking confident from behind the arc, but there's a lot of attempts going up. Hardy is out there with Kyrie Irving. Then it's Green, then it's Washington, and it's Gafford in at the pivot spot, batting the middle. So that's who Dallas starts the second with. Here's Hardy. Left side, Green. To the wing on the left. Here's Washington. P.J. Washington! And as someone whose career spanned eras, you feel playing defense is more difficult than it was two decades ago? Oh, B.A., yeah, it's much more difficult. In part, because the contact allowed is much more strict. Shooters can create contact and be rewarded with free throws, and the skill level on offense has truly raised. It makes it tough for the defender to really get down and play that tough in those defense. A chance here to catch up with Allie from the sideline. The Clippers are certainly a deep team, and Kawhi Leonard said they have a lot of talent. Hey! Hey! Hardy! Guard multiple positions, and I think that's what you need right now in the NBA. Guys that can guard, switch, and knock down open shots. Brian? 
Yeah, true enough. Valley thanks. Green, the pass to Washington. Irving for three. Three! Harry Irving! Irving, such a sharp shooter. Irving's gone a perfect two for two from beyond the arc. Here's Harden. And the shot James goes. Harden. Getting enough shots in close to play inside out. Second quarter basketball, just over a minute and a half played so far. Here's Hardy. Pass to Green. Here's Hardy. And out of bounds. Out of bounds. Out LA Clippers ball. He's a position on the court. Checked in for Green. Forty Clippers, number 14, Gary Smith. For Hardy. And number 40, Zubox. because of Box. checked in for Los Angeles. Man comes in for Highland. New substitution for back to the hands. Look at that catch. Harden the pass to Zubat. George with it. Pass to Man. It's George on the wing. Four three. James Harden for three. George. Our George with the assist. Nice play, George creating for others, just manufacturing some points. Here's Exum. Outside Irving. To the right side. Washington finds Gafford. P.J. Washington! He's got the second bucket. Like a matador. Ole! There was no defense. That has to be one of the easier shots I've seen tonight. Yeah, it feels like Christmas right now, just gift wrapping points. Now here's Harden. Five points in the game. Plays it up. James Harden. Harden's got seven points in the game. It's impressive how Harden makes room inside. He finds a way to navigate the shots. Doncic on the wing. Defended by Harden. Back to Doncic. Shoots over Harden. Rebounded by Kawhi Leonard. Well, maybe not the best shot against that kind of defense, but he still has the ability to knock that kind of shot down. Pass to Harden. From seven feet. And Catherine. Three checked in. Los Angeles keeps possession. Well, like Clippers ball. The Clippers making a switch here. Plumlee's checked Some in. Some additional LA Clippers number 44, Mason Plumlee. Just under three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. Here's George. And with that Ball one, George. Single digits. He has six. Well, the height and the length really helping PG get that one off. Washington outside. Back to Doncic. Shoots over Harden. And it's Doncic missing. Well, they shouldn't be giving that shot to anyone. They certainly shouldn't be giving it to him. That's a big break for the defense. James Harden for three. If so much of Harden's work happens at the top of the key, but he can also work you over from the corners. Here's Exum. Ooh, they can't stop the run with that one. And here's George. He'll bring it up for the Clippers. Trailing by five. Three friends. Three friends. Oh, George. Eagles of a guy like Paul George at his size being able to rip around and has total confidence in his ability to score. Doncic passes to Washington. Here's Irving. Kyrie Irving! He's got five points now in the quarter. They ran that play exactly as it was drawn up. Nice job. Three friends! Kyrie Irving's game. His ball handling is what still comes to mind first. Yeah, he'll be a man in his killer instinct. Clippers foul. And number 13, Paul George. His first personal foul. First team foul. The craftiest players in the league with the ball in his hands. Just a nightmare. Here he for Dallas Mavericks, number two. Kevin. Kyrie Irving.
First free throw is good. It's going to be something else. Good Here's substitution the for the Dallas Mavericks. Talent. And the Clippers will go for a different look here. Tucker's checked in for Zubats. Number two, Coffee comes Aaron Lively, in the bird. Norman Powell, Number 55, Joan, Derek Jones, Jr. Number seven, Hardaway, Jr. Tim Hardaway, Jr. No free throws good from Irving. Time called. Yeah, like Clippers call a timeout. Decides to talk it over. As so right now we are approaching down to the end of the first half. As we're getting ready for the halftime show. As we get you covered in right now here, as we start things off here, we've got a great match. It's right in between. Have you all call for Kenny Jet Smith with Ernie Johnson and Chad O'Neill. That'll be the halftime show on 2K Sports. A close game between the Clippers and the Dallas Mavericks. But what happens with other seasons? It calls for anybody that you can definitely keep an eye on it if you can watch any time right here on the playlist, only on Center Beast. And don't forget, we've got a great show in between the BFDI TPOT for the first three halves, and then the back three halves will be the TPOT to BFDIA on the other side. Catch all them around by subscribing to their channels. We'll take a quick break and get back into this. Halftime show is coming up, and we'll get you back in there every way soon. Let's have it over to you, dear Brian. All for you. See you all later. Back for the third quarter. Now Los Angeles with it. They're on a 14 to 6 run. Pass to Coffee. On the take. Another shot. Shot's blocked. Now here's Jones. No points yet. Here's Lively. On the wing, Irving. Checked by Tucker. The three, Gafford. And Tucker pulls it down for Los Angeles. They've gotten six of their 12 attempts to go since the end of the first. Pass to Powell. Right wing, a clear look for Westbrook, and they recover it, Coffee. they shoot again, blocked, Irving looking around, and Irving, and we'll go to the line, the shot's good for the Mavericks, defensive foul is on number zero, Russell Westbrook, his first personal foul, second team foul, at the free throw line, bucket and one, Kyrie Irving. down a mid-range jumper. Cleva outside. Back to Irving. Pass to Hardaway. On the wing, Jones. Outside Irving. Over to the wing. Six to shoot. Here's Cleva. Maxi Cleva! Los Angeles has gone two of four for the perimeter in the second so far. Coffee defended by Jones. Coffee can't get it to go. Dallas has gotten five of 11 threes to drop so far in this game. Pass to Irving. To the paint. Here's Lively. And good. Very lively. And now it's From Kyrie Irving. Now Irving is an excellent facilitator. He's going to have those big openings. He'll take advantage. Russell Westbrook. Westbrook. Or Rodas. Wow. Oh, 
Oh, it's fun to see point guards who can elevate above the rim like that. Oh, a strong mindset and even stronger finish. Well, just seeking out weaknesses in the defense and then exploiting it. And it's the Mavericks with the ball. The Clippers getting their last shot to go. Hardaway, the pass to Kleba. Clock at six. Right side, Irving. Pass to Lively. Over Portley. And that one's long. Well, the defense was right up on him, so electing to go for the fadeaway there to create some room. Well, that makes sense. Three seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Puts it up from 12. Lively grabs a miss. Hard away with it. That's it for the first half. Dallas Mavericks, 44. LA Clippers, 34. Allie's ready to go. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. I'm here with PJ Washington. PJ, what will be the key for you guys defensively in the second half? Uh, not let them get easy routes to the basket and uh, contest their shots, rebound it. Uh, not let them get second chance for it. Comes back to the fundamentals, guys. Thanks very much, Allie. We'll be back soon to start the second half of basketball. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. And what a show being put on here for the home fans tonight. I'm Ernie Johnson, along with Shaquille O'Neal and Kenny the Jet Smith. What a game it's been for Kyrie Irving. He had 13 points, 2 assists, and 2 rebounds. He didn't perform up to his standards in their last game. Tonight's a different story. He obviously has a short memory. Shaq, what's your take on that? Ball well, movement was a real factor for the moment. Guys got shots in their favorite spots. When you get those high percentage looks, good things tend to happen. Kenny, what's your take on the Clippers? They've been out of sync in this one, shooting under Going on this great look, look, up shots. I like to see them drive the basketball ball and get easy buckets. That about wraps it up. Time now for the second half of the game. We go to Kevin Harlan for the call. You've been watching the 2K Sports Halftime Show. And happy you could join us. We've got two quarters left to go in regulation. Well, you look at Kyrie Irving in this game. He's been everywhere. Can they come up with an answer for him coming out of the half? They have to change something defensively. They're just way too easy out there, and I'm sure Coach is going to make that a priority at halftime. Here are the Clippers. It's a 10-point game. And so in the game for Los Angeles, George and Kawhi, the talented forward pair. Terrence Mann is out there with James Harden. And it's Zubats in the center, filling out the middle. Here's Mann. Just five on the clock. Out to Leonard. Puts up a three. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Here's Doncic. and using his body to create good looks inside. Hart from outside. No luck on that one. Dallas has got five of 11 threes to drop so far in this game. Washington passes to Irving. Doncic outside. Outside Irving. And stolen by Leonard. Here in this third quarter, just over a minute play. Here's Zubats. Ooh, Washington with the defensive effort. I'm not going to see that very often. The defense in the vicinity, but still, he's not one to blow layups. Here's Doncic. Nice. Doncic! Doncic is a low down low. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. A rush stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with Allie LaForce. Go on, Leonard, for three. In the league, Mason Plumlee started shooting left-handed. He said, well, it felt good changing, and the more I practice, it just short of my decision. It's about the result, and I'm happy I made the change. I don't even question it, and that's where I like to be. Right? Go! 
Some heroic shooting in the second half. And so it's Doncic with it. He brings it up for the Dallas Mavericks. They lead by 11. Here's Washington. It's rebounded by Zubats. Zubats has got five rebounds tonight to the inside. Leonard can't get it to go. For Dallas, they've gotten three to four shots to fall so far in the third. Doncic against Harden. Puts it up from 15. Jones misses. Because of his quick reactions, he was able to stay with the opponent and contest the shot. We talk about versatility on offense a lot, but how about on defense? And he takes pride in making an impact down there. Boy, you love how guys are making plays for one another here. Yeah, just a balanced attack, a total team effort. Doncic passes to Gafford. Oh, solid D from Leonard. Hard to convert against that kind of defensive pressure. Those are all the little things about effort there. He just gets out there and contests, and that's just enough. James Harden for three. A shooter off the catch. Harden with that sweet lefty stroke. The Mavericks leading. Doncic outside. Down low. Deflects the pass. Gafford. Six points. Soft interior D, and they've exploited George feels it out of it. Pass to Zubats. On the wing, Harden. Six to shoot. Now Leonard fires from deep. It's rebounded by Dallas. Washington's got five rebounds in the game. On the wing, Leonard defending. Washington outside. Back to Jones. Pass to Irving. Fires the three. Paul George pulls it in. And locked down defense against one of the best three point shooters in the league. Paul George. Defensive foul foul on BJ Washington. His first personal foul. First team foul. And a look at how the offense is for the LA Number five. Unselfish play. Keeping that ball moving. Good shot to me later. Number 20. Daniel Price. In the mid range area has been their bread and butter. We're the Los Angeles Flipper for shooting one. Paul George. And the Mavericks going with a whole new group out there. And the Mavericks going with a whole new group out there. Yeah, I'm out Dallas. So much on both ends, so you get all-star value offensively and defensively. And Dallas calls time here. The NBA playoffs on 2K Sports is brought to you by Starry Lines. AT&T 5G. Connecting changes everything. And by State Farm. Like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. We got some great coming up stats right now as we have our next coming game coming up. That will be the last part of it. And for games tomorrow underway, we got our next one underway as we see the Sixers battling against the, the Celtics here in Philadelphia. And follow along for the next game as we have the Cavaliers facing against the Pacers at Indianapolis, Indiana at Gamebridge Fieldhouse. That will be the next afternoon games. And then, following along with the next tonight's game, it's for Denver Nuggets and the Warriors at 9.30. And then, 8.30 will be Pelicans and Bunnies. Now back to Brian. Harding, he's guarded by Highland. Outside Hardaway. Here's Green. 
This from James Harden. Harden. He's got three assists now on this one. Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. The coach over there just asking for one simple thing, and that's some effort. Got burned on that one. Here's Harden. Back to Green. George with a steal. Pass to Harden. Puts the move on. Now here's Leonard. Defense is right there. Off target with a jump hook. For Dallas, they've gone five for nine from the floor in the third quarter. Now Hardaway. Over Highland. Kicks it out to Hardaway. Here's Hardy. Shot clock at six. Dallas needs to get off the shot. Oh, George with a steal! Here's Highland. Three pointer, no good. Two minutes remaining in the third quarter. Two minutes. Three point range tonight. Hardy, pass to Lively. Denied by Leonard. One of the most versatile defenders in the NBA. Why Leonard getting all of that? And a fast break now. The Mavericks on the run. Lively with the ball. And he's rewarded at the end with the high percentage look. Yeah, the defense trying to do their best to slow him down. But when he gets room like that, you got to look at Kawhi out. Leonard. And he comes up with a bucket. And Kawhi just so ripped. Exceptional at powering through the contact. To the way, right side. Hardaway against Harden. Wing shot on the way. Damn, Hardaway Jr. We see this every night. He has the skill and versatility to keep a defense guessing. Pass to Leonard. 54 seconds left in the third. Fades back. That one rolls around and rims out. And it's power of the ball for the Dallas Mavericks. Here's Lively. Leonard defending. Harding. Here's Lively. No good on the triple. So disruptive defensively out beyond the arc. Yeah, you gotta like how he hustled to guard out on the perimeter, definitely respecting the shooting ability. The Mavericks have gotten 7 of 14 attempts to fall in the half. Here's Hardy. Pass to Hardaway. Let's it go from deep. Greetings, Hardaway Junior. Hardaway Junior's role is to be out there and run away. So that's the end of the third quarter. That's Dallas Mavericks, sixty-one, into the break. and LA Clippers, forty-nine. And that's why they're shooting at such a high clip. Time for a quick break, then back to the action. It's a close one here. We'll find out if the Clippers can get back into this. Ballpoint Pang will be back there soon. Fourth quarter's next. And a worthy candidate tonight as we take a look at our State Farm Assist of the Game. And just a selfless decision from your two guard, showing his ability to get his teammates good looks. What an advantage if your off guard can make plays so valuable. Quarter upon us. It's fourth quarter, everybody. Let's get go. Kyrie in the talented backcourt. Washington out there with Maxi Kleba. And it's Hardaway in at the three. That's the lineup in the game for Dallas. Now here's Washington. Doncic passes to Irving. Back to Doncic. Three pointer. Westbrook. To the 
right side. Zubox passes to Pumley, and here's Leonard. Back to Plumley. Pass to Powell. Over Irving. Doncic grabs a miss. Doncic has got his fifth rebound in this one. The three ball. Probably most proud of the effort of this team on both ends of the floor here tonight. Two points. Uh, Kawhi Leonard. Yeah, you can be as physical as you want with Kawhi Leonard. He just stays with it and is unshaken. We've gone about a minute and a half into this fourth quarter. Hardaway against Leonard. Pass to Doncic. To the middle. Shoots from 14. Hardaway, no good. I don't know if you can credit the defense for that. It was just a missed opportunity. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. Kawhi Leonard. A special delivery. What a powerhouse move from Kawhi getting right to the rim. Doncic against Zubats. Hardaway, the pass to Irving. And here's Washington. He's checked by Plumley. Here's Kleba. Maxi Kleba! you like to see guys go with the bounce pass, threading it through there perfectly. Westbrook taking his time here. Here's Plumley. That's good. Mason Plumley. Westbrook with the assist. This wrong. And those Russell are some Westbrook. Points, even with the defender draped all over him, Plumley works hard to get off a makeable shot. Pass to Irving. Over Powell. Kyrie Irving. He's totally relentless. Only increasing the intensity level. And he's the guy that you want to go to right now trying to put this one away. Now here's Powell. No good from 11 feet. Pass to Cleveland. Doncic's left side. Back to Kleba. Shoots over Zubats. No good on that one. His first miss. He's four for five now. Irving against Powell. Pass to Leonard. The shot comes out. Oh, great D that time from Doncic. Dallas is going two of two from outside so far in the fourth. To the inside. Kleba. Maxi! Kleba! From Luka Doncic. You can hit a teammate like that in stride. Beautiful assist. Timeout, LA Clippers. We're failing to find a rhythm offensively. Something that needs to change and change soon. Yeah, they're like a four day old soda right now, just whack. They're missing shots left and right and just not playing their best. We're getting down to the end of the line right now as we have our final game coming up. We've got the all time favorites, Sun to the Wolves, here at Footprint Center. It's going to be very close back. This range won't be stopping in if there's another takeover that we're looking for. It's how no matter what it is, you may never find it. What goes in? And let's see how they can do if they can try to handle it on their own. That'll be all the next part of the game after this final buzz sound from Dallas and Los Angeles. Now back to you, the folks. All right, we present our New Balance Player of the Game, Luka Doncic. The defense has just looked utterly lost trying to slow him down. He's consistently just getting high percentage shots because of how hard he's working. He's doing pretty much whatever he can to get open and <laughs> making the most of those opportunities. And you know, this home arena really appreciates this guy. And it's clear that he takes pride in playing his best in front of them.
Leonard. Mavericks with a rebound. Washington's got six rebounds here tonight. Leonard against Doncic. Back to Washington. Let's go with a three. Doncic, no good. And even after airtight defense like that, you still just expect him to hit those kind of shots. Here's Westbrook. And the Russell Westbrook. So active to score from a number of spots, but when Westbrook gets to the inside, he can do damage. Doncic against Westbrook. Pass to Exum. Here's Doncic. Five on the clock. Uh, Luca Duncan. This is how explosive Irving can be. Such a clever and versatile scorer. They get it back. Here's Leonard. Oh, oh Leonard. finishing traffic. My goodness. A stronger defensive presence would have saved them two points. It didn't seem like anybody was really aware there to go and collect that rebound in the possession. Now here's Washington. Pass to Irving. Over to the left wing. Here's Exum. Here's Kyle Exum! Devastating Kyrie can be scoring the basketball, but very encouraging to see how he's trying to set up his teammates as a playmaker right here. Doncic against Westbrook. Paul George. Uh, this is from see Paul George Birch that time. Russell Westbrook. The Mavericks have gotten seven of their first ten shots. Two minutes remaining in the fourth quarter. Second half, two minutes. We've got 155 left in the game. Doncic finds Irving. Here's Exum. Washington inside. Leonard defending. And it's Doncic missing. And so George will bring it up for the LA Clippers. They trail by 16. And George oh, with the jam. Well, once Paul George gets in that deep, get out of the way. He's coming right at you. Dallas has gone two of three from beyond the arc here in the fourth. Westbrook against Doncic. The three from Washington. Free Washington. They came out in the fourth quarter tonight. A fantastic effort to get it done here for the Mavericks. Offensively, they made the most of their trips. They found multiple ways to score consistently, and a little luck doesn't hurt them either. They also got some nice bounces off the rim tonight, too. And it was a reliably solid performance from one of their key guys. A tremendous game for Luka Doncic. He really influenced the game with his rebounding. Just a stellar performance. With all the work he put in, he's going to sleep well tonight. Yeah, I guess so. It's just when you don't even get it. You may never expect it what it's going to look like. But how much you have to do it? Ah, uh, well. I don't know what you can do. But that may be a change off if you can't let them stop or slow down. You may not know how this is going to happen. But you can't let that one fool over you if another take comes in. I don't know what to tell you now. But you've got to make sure you have to keep an eye on it right away. And that's the hard part. Just go for your best if you can. New substitution up for the Mavericks, number yeah, seven, D.Y. Powell. Powell. Different look here. Tice has checked in for Zubats. Tucker comes in for Kawhi Leonard. Coffee, he's checked in for Paul George. And it's Highland in for man. Dallas has got three threes to fall out of four attempts here in the fourth. Pass to Hardy. 59 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Out to the right wing. And it's Washington missing. Here's Coffee going inside. Westbrook finds Tice. Count it. Daniel Price. 
when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. Yeah, coach over there just asking for one simple thing, and that's some effort. Got burned on that one. Now here's Irving. 23 seconds left in the final quarter. Four second shot clock violation. Clippers ball. And for our final substitution goal, already Clippers, Norman Powell, and Nate Ren Highland. There's 10 seconds left to play in the fourth. Now Highland. Game. Dallas yeah. Mavericks 80 and LA Clippers 65. You saw their activity level go up. It's just a tremendous performance. Support is now, now a minute to check in with Allie LaForce. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Kyrie, the offense was clicking tonight. Can you talk about the impact of ball movement on your success? It's very important. Um, we trust each other like that on both ends of the floor, especially offensively. It makes it easier for all of us to be aggressive, and I think that we did a great job of that tonight. Um, we just got to keep it going. Fans deserve us to move up in these standings, man. We got some work to do. We got some work to do. This team is as deep as it gets. They're all willing to put the work in, guys. Allie, thank you as always. And that about wraps it up. For Brent Barrett, Grant Hill, and Allie LaForce, this is Brian Anderson. Thank you for watching this 2K Sports presentation of the NBA. We'll see you next time. Have a great evening. All right there, Brian, thank you so much. We have a great time right now here in Dallas as this one's starting to be great and enjoying a part of it in Texas. We love this state. Yeah, I know. I was not even expecting the Dallas Mavericks. They were playing it like they've always done. But sometimes, however, I was able to see what goes in there. But why not? It's a great way that they've all been loving it too. Now, let's have a look at the different comparison between. 60 and 50% of the field goals and three-pointers was the Dallas Mavericks. 100% for the free throws was only Los Angeles Clippers. Then fast break points was 9 for Dallas Mavericks. 44 points in the paint for Los Angeles Clippers with 8 second chance points. Ben 30 and 29 bench points and assist. Got a lot of it right now. The Dallas Mavericks are already like fly fighting it on the bowl. 15 offensive rebounds for Los Angeles Clippers and 27 for Dallas Mavericks. Only 3-3 three and three evened up here. Six blocks for Dallas Mavericks. I mean, that's crazy. And then it was only five turnovers and the points turned off. That turned to be for Dallas. Two team fouls for Los Angeles. Is eight dunks on Los Angeles. Then 18 biggest lead and 17 minutes was their time of possession for the Dallas Mavericks. So, I guess... I guess we got a good way, but we got one more to say right now. It's time to present your New Balance suit to get ready for goal. And then we've got three star players of the game. Boomer, you think? All right, thank you so much. Time for three star players of the game. Third star starts things off here. We give a good look here right in between of us two. But I would say it's now. What can I say? Well, here's the thing. I, it's only this guy. Kawhi Leonard, he has only had one block and one steal. Only seven rebounds and has been taken over on Lively. Then it was fifth, 13 points, six out of 18 field goals with one three-pointer and four three-pointers on the other hand. Only 13 performances and then one dunk was remained. Now for number two star, I'm going to talk through it. It's close enough, but it's not what you always take. The harder one is going to take all the time. Luka Doncic with 17 points, 7 rebounds, 6 assists, 7 out of 13 field goals, and only 3 out of 6, 8, 6, uh, 3 point range of the set. Then it was 13, 30 performance effort. The Euro League stepper doesn't have that one what it takes, but it's just all you can definitely step in. So let me a team, it's just a hard one that you go with. And your number one star for a New Balance player to gain, Uncle Drew, Kyrie Irving. 20 points, 3 rebounds, 6 assists, only 7 out of 8 field goals, 
three three-pointers, four three-pointers. It was 35 performance effort. He's doing really well in game three. Keeping on it like a legit. And that's going to take out of time right now. We hope you enjoyed the part of the game. And then if you're ready to stick around here for the next part of the game, we've got the Wolves and the Suns. That will be the last part of the game in day number one. And then following along with that one here will be the next couple of games. So keep your eyes peeled here as we've got another matchup for you. And we've got the Sixers and its Celtics at Wells Fargo Center. That will be happening at 1 p.m. 3.30 p.m. That will start with the Cavaliers and the Pacers at Gamebridge Fieldhouse. Then at 8.30 p.m. It's the Pelicans versus against the OKC Funders in New Orleans at Smoothie King Center. Then finally we have is the Nuggets and the Warriors at Chase Center in San Francisco at 10 p.m. Well, that's going to be a little bit of change off right in between, but 9.30 will be uh, preparation ready to get this thing going with 30, or 30 minutes underneath to surface. And then after that, it'll be finished for now. And then we will get back into Game 4. Yeah, definitely true. I mean, never going to let that happen. Just slow things off with the take. In the meantime, thank you all so much for watching. And it's all with the appreciation for everybody who is watching. Um, you guys are the best. Enjoy yourself and then have fun watching the NBA playoffs if you enjoyed it. Peace out, folks, for a while as the NBA playoffs on 2K Sports Style. And this is Lightbulb and Boomer. Thanks for joining with us. Have a great evening in Dallas and Los Angeles. Until next time. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.